Alright, this is how I broke my leg and ankle. Is it ankle and leg? Ankle and leg. Ankle and leg and playing basketball with him. Tibia. It's all his fault. And tibia. I like the name. Yeah, it's only his fault. It's not. So, no, stop it, not yet. So, this is me breaking my foot, the story of me getting. They can't see it. There's no way they can see it. Oh, so, um, me breaking my foot and ankle, having my tibia come out of my leg, and my tibia breaking and having 11 screws through my leg. And it was sad. So, I'm going to start this off with that me and Preston go play pick up basketball for Rec at AM. 3.30. Was that the time? 3.30. Uh, no, it was a. Uh, I met him at 5 30. We were saying 5 30. He was bad. Um, okay. We couldn't find a place for a while. Um, he gets sick. And so then we go to the back courts. We play. We win. No, we win. We win. We won the first game. We had like 45 minutes. Yeah. It was really bad. But we won the first game, so we're playing the second game. Um, we have a good team. We're a pretty good team. Um, and so it all started. Oh no. It all started with me stealing a basketball. It was a pretty good steal. I'll give you that. It was pretty He's good. He's gonna give me that. I steal it, I run full sprint down court, and we do a layup. The guy comes beside me, not a big deal. Everyone comes beside me, kind of block the layup. Yeah. He comes a little bit faster than I thought he was gonna go. I decide to step into the layup like you do. Yeah, but we'll slow it down. Yeah. And his foot was there, so I stepped on his foot, and instead of rolling my ankle, I went the other way. It so it went way more the other way. This, so you roll your ankle. I went the other way, and so the other way is when Tibby came out, and my other brother broke. Pull up this. So it went like, yeah. Instead of rolling the ankle, I went that way. The bone came out here, and this side was broken. Medical room is watching. Uh, yeah, you keep talking about the medical stuff. The Preston was there and he saw it. I saw it and it was just, it was too much to handle. I don't think I processed things like that well. I don't think I processed trauma well. Um, there were the girls on these bikes at one time. Like, just long story short, I just, I really didn't know what to do. Um, this time I was like, I really don't know what to do. I looked and I didn't see it at first, but it was. It was Everyone just thought I rolled. I hurt my ankle. I you rolled my ankle. As well as me. Thought, thought it was rolled and it was bent. It was bent is what I saw at first, so I didn't see it. And I was like, oh no, it's bent. That's wrong. So I literally freaked out a little bit. And then went over and I was like, oh hey, how about how old? I need some relaxed face. And uh, then I went down and I did not know that it was an open fracture and we could see his bone. And uh, I looked and I was like, oh, well, I like to call it a mini shock. I like a mini shock. And uh, yeah, I went down and I was like, it's not that bad. Every time he said it was not that bad, I was like, you're lying to me. It was, after that, I regained my calm, started lying more. Uh, so before, before when, I, when I hit the guy's foot, I fell down like immediately. And I slid to kind of past the baseline. And then. I knew I hurt my foot, but I was just like, oh, whatever. And I look at my foot, and I see my foot's hanging off, and I feel it dangle. Literally hanging. Um, yeah, I, feel, I felt it dangle without my control, and then I saw my bone. And my exact, my exact thought was, <laughs> I really messed up this time. And then that's when everyone, I saw everyone's reactions, and then I saw Preston come up to me and say, relax your face. It was too much. Because I like grunted, I don't know, twice. Oh, yeah. I, was like, I had a pretty bad face, probably. I'm actually feeling sick. This is not a joke. I'm feeling sick. And so basically that happened, and then they went, did you go to the EMT? Someone uh, got the EMT. No, I just yelled at somebody to go. I didn't yell, but I was mildly polite given the circumstances. Yeah, you were very forceful. Yeah, yeah, I was forceful with my words. I was like, go to the EMT people now. And then that guy went. He was like, okay. And then he ran. He ran and I just saw him walking back with the lady. 
And I don't think she knew what was happening. No. Because when she got there, she was like, her eyes just got way too big for her. I was like, you've never seen anything like this. Have you? <laughs> no one saw that no, no one, not even the doctors. Um, so, the EMT gets there, she realizes that she's out of her hands, uh, calls the actual, uh, what is it, butyl, yeah. hands, medical people. EMT, like par- the actual paramedics. But paramedics. So they start driving over. I'm in a lot of pain. I relax a little bit, given to the situation, I guess. But I didn't go into like total shock, I guess, because I still felt a lot of pain. So people say when you go into shock, you don't feel anything. Okay. Yeah. I did like that a lot. Your vision blurred as well, so that's good. Yeah. Uh, that was bad. Yeah, so I felt, I felt it all. So I guess that's a bad thing. And someone tried to take a picture. Oh, and then there was a guy who decided who we were playing with, I think. It was and he walked beside me, he had his phone, and he just kind of put it up and it was like that, and then walked off. And I saw him out of the corner of my eye. He knew. I knew that he knew he took pictures of me. I'd like to say that later on, I chased him down and beat him up. He didn't do me anything. I didn't have him. He didn't see it happen. Well, I actually ended up taking up my own pictures. Yeah, I did. I was cool. I left. We called him. He left me in them. No, I called him. I called him. And then um, the EMT lady, she doesn't know what to do. I don't think she's ever done this in her life. And uh, she's like, wow, well, you should go wait outside for the ambulance. I told them that they'd be at one of the And I was like, what's your entrance? And she's like, probably the front one. And I was like, right. Okay, so wait at the front. I start sprinting as fast as I've ever sprinted before. I sprint past the front desk lady. And she looked very, she looked sicker than Jacob did. And uh, I told her, I said, you shouldn't let anybody on the back court, on this side of the field, blah, 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 or on the courts. And then she was like, oh, I was like, I was just, sir, I don't know. I was like, no time. And I left. And then, then uh, she didn't do anything, apparently. Um, and then I went outside. I'm like, oh, okay, where's this ambulance going to come from? I'm listening for sounds. My eyes, ears, and heart are open. And I'm, I'm listening, and I hear an ambulance. I'm like, oh, great. And then it goes past our entrance, and I was like, that's not right. And I was like, we're probably going back. And then I, I sprinted to the back as fast as I could. And then I get there, I see the paramedics, I'm like, oh, they're not in nearly the same hurry that I am. And I just go up there, and like, I had a rhythm, like, he's over here. And then they're like, okay, show us where he is. And I'm like, okay, come on. And then I start like doing like a half jog, and they're just walking. And it takes it us was a couple minutes here earlier. And I remember they were coming in pretty slow. They were very slow. And, and that was that's all I remember from that point until they get there. And they start doing vitals. And they do the vitals. Blood you asked for drugs. Yeah, I thought vitals meant drugs at the point because I was really wanting drugs. Okay. And I was just totally off. Um, so they came to cut my shoe off, cut my sock off. They put me in a splint, air splint thing. It was painful. Um, yeah, but taking the shoe off was better a lot. Um, and then they had a stretcher for me. That's good. I've seen the dice. Um, so they put me on the stretcher. Um, after they put the splint on, uh, they took me out. While I was going out, I could see everyone's faces being ghostly. Yeah, and everybody was shocked. Everyone was kind of shocked. So I still got stood every time I thought about it. So you can see the next <laughs> remark. I want to do this. Um, so yeah. So they take me to the ambulance. It takes a while. I finally get fentanyl in the ambulance. Um, going to the hospital. They take me to St. Joseph's. Um, what's it called? St. Joseph's. Oh, St. Cod. Right. Yeah, I was saying. Yeah, St. Joseph's. Okay, basically St. Joseph's. I go into the critical... The emergency room. Trauma one. Trauma one. Whatever that means. I don't know. It's good. Um, you were trauma one. So, I get put in there. Backs through on the EMTs. Um, I, one of my former roommates, friend as well, um, knew the EMTs. Talk about you. And they still think, they really talked about me for a long time. Um, and they basically said that my ankle's hanging off and I really didn't really exaggerate that, so I guess it was pretty bad. This is a very good picture. I spent um, some time around. Please don't show that. Uh, 
So back to the hospital. Preston eventually finds me after they give me some to no help the team. No help the team. Just throw it out there. <laughs> they didn't do a good job. Who? If you're watching. They didn't even tell me you were. Like, oh. He's probably not going to So they gave me morphine in there. Oh, I had two IVs in me. Um, Preston comes. They talk to me a lot and ask a thousand questions, in which I say about the same thing about every time. I remember looking at your leg as a side note and being, wow. He's got a lot of different tabs than I thought he had. I remember that. Just, just throw it out there. Thanks, man. I was like, yeah, they're thicker than him. Yeah. They're not good for you. Um, uh, and basically, okay, this is my note. It was bad. Even the nurses and PAs wanted pictures of my leg. Yeah. Um, and they were kind of excited about it. Because they had never, they were they've very, never seen it before. They were very confused. They weren't confused. They were excited. They were, they were, yeah, they were something. Um, which was definitely weird. So, I'm like in shock. That's never good for the medical professionals to be in shock. Well, I've never seen this. Come take a picture of it. Well, I'm going to show the nightmares before she comes in. Um, and then Preston took pictures. I took a live. Yeah. Um, cool. There, she took pictures. And his fiance was there. Well, grew up in the yeah. fiance now. Was there. Eventually. Eventually. Um, we were good. It's <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, that's not true. Um, he's getting married. <laughs> it's true. Um, so what, what, what show where should we go after this? Um, maybe to your, your pig. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, okay. So, <laughs> so we talk a while, I talk to President Coral for a while, um, and I guess they're calling people for the surgery yeah. because they felt sticking out, so the cap did surgery. Tell me something to you. Um, so the first part of the surgery, was we're not in surgery, but we're supposed to put the bone back into the leg. Uh, so they put me asleep, they gave me some poor tranquilizer. Mm -hmm. it, well, it was ketamine. Ketamine. Uh, so they gave me ketamine, and this stuff was really good. Uh, it was so, evidently, well, uh, the For first horse, part it's a horse track. Yeah. Here. So, first part was I, they put it, they gave it to me, I felt like I was in a cloud, and then eventually I felt like I was in a sunset world. Uh, <laughs> So and, and I was like in, on like a cloud, and I kept trying to say different things and I couldn't say them. No, he didn't like, say that. Did you remember when I said it? I was like, no, um, in my little dream state thing, and I kept trying to say my body's better vessel. Couldn't say that. Women's soccer. Um, oh yeah, there's a, there's a aim of soccer game going on. Yeah, yeah, I was into that. Trying really, to figure that out. Really into that. We talked about that for oh, quite a while. Did we? We did ask him to talk about that for at least. Ten minutes for that. You probably think you just mentioned it, but we did talk about like five ten minutes. Like, this one girl like, is just like killing. I'm like, oh, the girl on the white, and you're like, yeah, she's killing. Like, she's not on our team. I do not remember. <laughs> I do remember asking my room when I woke up, I was like, what's the score? Because I don't know oh, what yeah. the score was. Uh -huh. um, and I talked to the doctor, I mean, she, he made me sign something, I don't remember what I signed. Um, I said yeah. something. Uh, some like surgical release. Yes, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. surgical thing. I totally, I, I released you. Oh, did you really? That's what it was for. I, re I released you to do like certain. Like, is this your blood? Like, yeah, sure. Okay, we need to sign this. And, like, right, I'll sign it later. What are you going to do? Did you get one of those kidneys? Okay. Uh, so, I, I kind of get out of the drugs, but not enough where I don't really remember. I don't, I don't they, they came and talked to me. They tried to set his leg. Um, but yeah, Apparently it was, that yeah, so it didn't work, which was bad. Um, <laughs> but I didn't really remember talking to them because we had a decent conversation. Yeah, we had a pretty long conversation. It was like okay, at least I uh, really had like thirty minutes after we came back. Okay, because I remember you guys coming. I came back and we were talking. Yeah, no, we came back and talked for a little while. Oh, we walked over there to to surgery. Okay, I don't remember that at all. Yeah, I, I remember. I remember talking to her about drones. Yeah, we're going to do the whole way talking. I don't remember you at all. Well, we, hey, I think I remember you in the elevator. Oh, was an elevator, right? Yeah, there's an elevator. The big elevator. And then there's a door, and that you guys were like, oh, you can't go there? Yeah. Oh, maybe do it a little bit. Yeah, yeah. That's when we were, we were talking about your own. I heard so there, you're like, oh, like, we were talking about your major there. And you were really talking about your major, and she was just sitting there like, yeah. Yeah. She, I don't think she knew that, like, 
No, I think you were saying what accurate, but I don't think she expected it to be. <laughs> she was just like, yeah. She yeah, okay. disagreed with it. Okay, drones. Yeah, you do drones. Um, <laughs> so I mean, I talked, I guess, decently. Yeah, I didn't think anything was wrong. Um, so that oh, happened. Yeah. I went to the surgery room. They put me. They actually put me to sleep this time. Like a sleep. Like sleep. a sleep. Yeah. Um, and and that surgery happened at what time? The health surgery happened at like eleven thirty. Eleven thirty. And then at night. Cole and I decided because Cole, Cole was there. They were like, "Well, the surgery's gonna take three hours." They're like, "But we got like two, two, four hours." And so we're like, "Okay." Um, she's like, "You should wait here." And we're like, "Okay." And then we went to go get pancakes at um, the kettle. And I felt sick after because so it wasn't working, but decided to. Um, so I wake up at like one thirty. Oh, alone, scared. I, I was alone. Crying. I definitely was alone. Um, <laughs> How did I get here? I was confused. Um, <laughs> and then it's really funny. They put me in a room. I was on. There was a TV on, so I watched TV for a little bit. So I couldn't fall asleep. It's like two IVs, and every time I moved, they would beep. So oh. I couldn't fall asleep. And I was still in a little bit of pain. Um, it's your legs and all. Yeah, I mean, I guess. So I was there. I didn't, I only had like sleep to like three, but it wasn't good sleep. It was good sleep. It wasn't good sleep. Oh, yeah. it was bad sleep. Yeah, definitely. Not. Um, yeah, I probably I stayed awake for two hours. I had a peanut mm-hmm. bottle. Um, <laughs> that was weird. Because again, the, the yeah. IV stuff. And you're super demanding too, so you make people clean it up. Okay, I did that. That's a lie. <laughs> um, I don't remember what they after that. Yeah. After that. Oh wait, yeah, yeah. I woke up the next morning. Oh, this is this is a good part. I didn't tell my parents. Oh, that's like until eight. Until, until eight the next day. I decided eight they would be up, so I called them right away. You did my car, right? Huh? Did you do my car? No. Oh. Yeah, I had my car with me. Oh. Um, you, you, he, he gave me my stuff for you. Yeah. Gave it to the diner or whatever. I'm like, please take this and please don't lose it. I said that like three times. I was like, you promise this won't get lost? I'm watching videos. Everybody was stuck in the lost. Okay. I'm like, well, please don't lose this. He's gonna be so mad. He's probably so already wanting to lose it. I don't know. I was kind of dazed. <laughs> anything. But, anyways, I call my parents at A. I call my mom. She doesn't answer, which is rare. Don't and I need her. She doesn't answer. Um, mm-hmm. And then. Uh, <laughs> And then, <laughs> uh, and then my, I call my dad. Oh, no, 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 I call my brother. I don't like to tell you. I call my oldest brother. <laughs> and he picks up and I tell him about it. Oh, yeah, I don't know you that. And then he he was like, I think I call mom and dad. I was like, nope. <laughs> he was like, call them. I was like, okay. Um, so then I call my dad, who never answers. And he answers. He picks up and he's like, uh, what's it, buddy? How you doing? Or something like that. And I was like, oh, well, <laughs> I broke my leg last night. <laughs> and and right right then he's like, hold on, I want to go get mom. <laughs> so he goes to my mom and, mom. and he, said, he said, tell mom what you did. And then I tell my mom. And she was not happy with me at all. Um, I don't do what? I can see why. But I was very, I, I did this because I was calm. I didn't have any trouble. Well, I had any brain huh. so I just don't. That would have been bad. Um, so I was quite calm, which I think helped that part, yeah. Um, the sense of deal. And very sensitive. Especially with mom. Yes. So she still hates me for that. Um, <laughs> That's funny. Uh, or at least give me a So that happened that morning. And then later, Preston and Coral come get me at 11? We're supposed to, well, we're supposed to be at 11. They ended up getting there at 12.30. Oh, um, they didn't release me for like. I remember being a little late. I felt bad. I was like, oh, come on. <laughs> I don't remember that. I, okay, good. Yeah, because I remember being late. I was like, come on. <laughs> I remember they didn't release me for a while. I was really mad. You had your phone. Oh, really? <laughs> yes, I was really upset. I either woke up from a text from you or I texted you and I was like, oh, good, you got his phone. I, I, think I, did, I think I texted you, and I was like, oh, mom. Okay, yeah. Um, they're thinking about releasing me around this time. 
Yeah, I'm like 12 30. I don't yeah. know that. I remember that text. I was I was kidding. Like, I didn't get. <laughs> probably not as bad as it was, obviously. If I remember sitting here like that time, I was like, I would wake up every couple of times, you gotta make sure to get them a lot. <laughs> you gotta make sure. Did you tell our other roommates either? No, I didn't. So they didn't know. They're that. young. That's the problem. They're young. I don't know if they could see it. I didn't know. So, so you came down here. Came here. Coral was here. We came to crutches. I came to crutches. Didn't, didn't know yet as well outside of the basketball room, so I didn't really know too much what to say. I was like, my legs broke. Might as well just give my heart attack for that. And uh, did you give me heart attack? I don't remember that. Probably. No, I know I know did. You probably did. We're in the shit place. No, we were making fun. Like, even mm-hmm. though the, ne- the last time I broke my leg in the hospital, I, we were still giving each other heart attacks. Yeah, yeah. Right, and stuff. It, was, like, it was pretty funny. <laughs> and the guy, one of the nurses, was like, I really like you guys. You move. Like, you <laughs> yeah. get along. Yeah. yeah, he said something. Oh, the male nurse seems pretty cool. Yeah. Or whatever he was, but. So, even when we're in pain, I still give heart attacks. Yeah. It was pretty good. You can't you want to give people a hard time, especially when they're down. Like, <laughs> if you kick them while you're down, it just shows. They just, no, you don't really like them. You really like them, yeah. You just don't really. It just is. Um, you know, you should do that. So, um, we, we go to Smoothie King. Go to Smoothie King, Cole, obviously. I had not done that at home. Or did you do that? I don't know what happened. I don't know. Cole, I was really. I think mean, she did. I don't know. She sounds like the same shoes you Yeah, she totally did. Um, we'll give credit to her. Yeah. Thanks, Cole. Um, and then I go home, oh, they gave me some, oh, wait, no, they gave me prescriptions, antibiotics. Yes. They gave me a lot. And they gave me a lot of, oh, what's it called? Hydro, they did hydrocodone. Oh, hydrocodone or oxycodone, one of the two. One of those, they gave me like a, a lot. Um, yeah. And I didn't use, I only used like 10, or maybe 15, somewhere <laughs> around there, out of the yeah. 60 that I had. Which is good. Um, that was bad. So, and then I was doing Splint for a week. Oh, I got, yeah, I forgot about that. So yeah, so I was in the spent for a whole week. They never put you in the Yeah, it was just that splint. That's kind of cool. And then, I think it was because there's a reason for that. Yeah. yeah. They, they, they told me a reason. I don't care. I can't remember why. Um, oh, God, I, think much of that. Yeah. I think it was the, the bone coming out. I think it was something like that. Yeah, it was something like that. That's why they, they couldn't like, put you in the cast. Oh, that was because they needed to see the stitches and stuff. Yeah. Oh, um, but whatever. Oh, God. Um, oh yeah, they had to take more X-rays. Oh yeah, right. Yeah, because they took X-rays the next time I went there. Um, so they took the cast off or the splint in a week, and I got precision out one week later on my right side where my tibia is, and then another two weeks or another week, and then I got my tibia side stitches out. And it was so serious because you have you have you have plates in your leg forever. Yes. Picture in the video now. There we go. It's in there. That's what it looks like. Yeah. I'm glad we had it. And little screws bro. Oh, okay. So fast forward. Um, oh, yeah. That's okay. Yeah. You skip. Oh, okay. So I get through the boot. Uh, <laughs> in the boot. Then, I don't know how long it was. Uh, basically, all September I was in crutches. All of October I was in crutches. That's sad time. Um, Part of November, half of November, I was on crutches. And then I went to boot, walked on the boot, and then I went to walking. And that went through all the way till November. It got November. better in the holiday season. Yeah. Um, Which is good. So by November, I could walk slowly. It was really slow. Yeah, it was really slow. It was very slow. And then it got a lot faster. Yeah, I was kind of pushing it. Um, and then you were good. Okay. It's the hand yeah. skin. Oh my gosh. So meantime, in somewhere in there I broke my screws. There's a screw that goes between the tibia and tibia. I broke that. Um, also in this time, in November to now, I did 10 physical therapy things. Yeah. So that also helped with going faster. Yeah, oh yeah. The, the screw you said really hurt. Yeah, the, when it broke, the screw broke, at least one thing it broke, I couldn't walk. And I was out for a walk. So I hobbled back to the house. And oh. they took some really good medicine. That was too bad. Uh, kind of let them off the worse every time. <laughs> so that, and also, I can also feel one of the screws in my leg. So that's good. That's, a, that's another thing. That'll come back later, I'm sure. Um, and then I ran for the first time. 
or Jug. I don't know. Jug. That's a totally different thing. They're very different. Um, what's, what's, what was yesterday? Yesterday was the 16th. 16th of December. That was my first First run. Jog. This is the whole semester. This is the semester yeah. over. Yeah. From the beginning of the end, the whole semester. So it happened September 1st. Surgery happened? Yeah. Okay. And then December 16th. Oh, yeah. Actually, he was a lot more than I thought it was. They thought, yeah, they thought I wasn't going to walk the stage. Yeah. Or at least be the food in yeah. walking the stage. Now, can we not have food anymore? I did not do that. I walked the stage. Insert video. Yeah. Yeah. Not really. <laughs> Ooh, Maybe I will. Oh, no. um, do you have a bit of it? Yeah. Oh. Uh, <laughs> so mean. I almost showed up. I know. I'm like, mm, that thing. Whatever that means. Um, <laughs> you. Two point one. Um, and that's that's the thing. That's all of it. Every time I had a shower, we had to put it. Oh, you saran wrap. On. Yeah, I put so. For the boot, well, and the splint, and the boot. Well, actually, no, for the splint, I didn't take a shower the whole week. I don't think you did that. No, but I'm impressed. I didn't take a shower until that Sunday after it happened. It took a long time. Because I was like, I just, oh, I, I didn't feel very well. I, I just like, I broke my leg. I don't remember it. It makes sense. Um, energized to do anything. I don't believe you. Um, so, that's just brutal. I would toss and wrap my boot, because it couldn't, or my injuries couldn't get wet. And my boot couldn't get wet. So I had a plastic wrap it and then put um, electrical tape on the top so it would seal it off. And I did that about I don't know, 10 times. And let's not forget about the kid who Jacob's foot oh. landed on. This poor young man. We're going back in time with that. I, just, I almost forgot. He should be putting this video. I don't know what his name is, but for the sake of the video, his name's Wallace. Wallace no. held his leg, and so props to you, Wallace. Oh yeah, he did. He, he held my calf. He held his calf. He held my calf, and he said sorry. Yeah, and he said he was. He was like sorry. He apologized, and I was just like, you're fine. Um, and and I didn't like care because I was really pain. No one forgot about that, Wallace. He's not Wallace. Why do you say that? Furious at you. Um, what you saw the video? That'd be bad. That'd be hilarious. I don't want him to comment. He comments. Screw you. <laughs> um, but yeah, that should be fun too. He, he, was, he was definitely there. Wallace was there. Uh, Preston had issues going back to the wreck. I did. Like, oh yeah, that's all I wanted to mention. The first time I went back to the wreck, I felt really nauseous. And I, I was gonna lift weights, and it was a leg day, and I was like, I don't know. Like, maybe I'll just switch it back. <laughs> and then I switched it. And then I saw a basketball, and I was like, I don't think I'm good. Oh my gosh. And so I didn't play. And actually, I think it took me like a month and a half to play basketball. Yeah, it took you a while. I really didn't go back. I like went on runs. And then you kind of hurt his ankle and freaked oh, out. Oh god, freaked out. We're really bad. Yeah, that was, that's like two months away though. That was two months after. Yeah. That was like, like in late November. I was playing basketball and I fell down. Like, alright, I twisted my ankle and fell down. And like I had an, inter an internal freak out, like I don't care. Like, it was like it was like four of being like I don't know, like it was panic like, attack. I did. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I had a super, like I had a panic attack for like seven minutes. I was like oh, oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> and I felt my leg. I remember I felt my leg, and I was like, thank you, Lord, that my leg is still here. I mean, I was like crazy, like sincere about it too. I was like, I'm oh, so glad that this is here right now. So that just shows me I, I was really traumatized. So. Yeah, that's that's what happened. That's, 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 that's what happened. That's the story. And I was sore because you ran the other day. Yeah, I ran and I ran a mile. Jump, jog a mile. I should say jog. Oh, it was a good pace. It was like um, a nine-minute pace. Oh, really? Okay, yeah. I wanted to jog. That's how I jogged for me. He said five minutes in high school. Yeah, I had like five minutes in high school. So it's kind of slow. But whatever. I'm still very sore. Um, don't do that to me. In weird places, too. He, he's not going to like your butt. He, he's not going to do that. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I'm sure this will get edited out. I want to leave everything you did, man. The whole video, the whole 
Yes. Is there anything else we should say? Yeah, because we just added that space. Is there anything else? Um, um, my parents came down a few times. Um, but I mean, that's, that's just. Yeah. Um, there's some girls that saw something with a girl in there, too. Didn't she, like. No, I saw them telling if that happened. Mm. I don't think so. People, I was actually at church once, and a guy came up to me and, and recognized me. I was like, are you the basketball guy? And he was there when it happened. And he told me that like 40% of everyone left, I believe. Like, <laughs> um, Bye. But, that's, but he knew me just from the basketball thing. I was famous. Which is kind of funny. And the wreck had a safety meeting about me as well. That's funny too. Also, there was blood. Or brought me up at least. Oh, I didn't know it was a safety meeting, but no. I brought up in the safety meeting. Um, I shouldn't have done it. Um, that would have really been like the video was worth doing because your leg was so messed up. Like it was like literally dangling at like a ninety degree angle, like from here to here. Like it was like ninety degrees. I can't. Well, it was it was it was that way, right? Yeah, it was hanging yeah, down. Yeah, right it was like this, but like ninety degrees. Like the bottom of his foot would be over here. It was like so long. It was so, just so long. This was like here. Right? It's too much. Uh, yeah. Like, yep. And then the bone was out here. And you can see it. Right? Yeah, the bone was long. Obviously, it was covered. Yeah, yeah. It was like out here. Yeah. It, it was, was like this. Look, this is a good view. It was really bad. And it was incredibly white. It was like purpley white. And also, weird. I think I touched it too. On accident. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. I felt it. <laughs> this piece was so jank. That's <laughs> hot. It was okay. Uh, I'm one of those people that should never be in front of a camera. You shouldn't. 